What is up, my guys? I do welcome to my channel. It's your boy, and I'm back again. I know I've been releasing quite a lot of car videos, and that's not going to stop, guys. However, fashion comes first on this channel. One thing I did say like last year is I will switch over the cars to a new different channel, and this will just be purely a fashion channel. So bear with me while we get a lot of subscribers. Once I've got like at least 10,000 subscribers on this channel, then I'll be able to move the car channel to the different new channel that will just be purely based on cars and this will be a fashion channel as well at the same time if you love cars you know i'll try and make the videos as interesting as possible so we've got these air journal one low homage black white that are due to come out so i'll show you guys in a couple of seconds what i'm looking at we'll take information from the supplier so make sure you guys subscribe as well and bam as you guys can see there these are beautiful shoes from the side they look like nike dunk low retro the black and white aka the panda laws however there's a trick up this shoe sleeve which i'll show you in a couple of seconds as i swipe from right to left bam that is a the trick there guys so this shoe has been cut in half basically so just for more clarity that shows the shoe in a better angle so basically what i've done is they've made panels on each side to oppose the other side so in essence if you look at the um the toe box, you'll find it's black and white on the other side. So the same design language is across each side of the shoe. It always opposes. Normally, you find like, you know, the inside will always mirror the outside of the shoe. But this time, it's opposing it. It's a simple, you know, uh, thing, but it's nice as well. It works. There was a Jordan that was made, I think, back in 2018, which had this concept as well. And it did work, and I think... No, now as well it does work as well so we've seen oh let me show you what i just <laughs> as i was saying excuse the uh ashy knuckles i've been running in the rain and you know yeah the rain's not good for my skin but yeah um i think it works i like it it's 115 pounds this is due to come out on july the first i think in america they got them first before us in europe so you know hence why people are you know uh, unboxing them on youtube i will try and get a pair just for unboxing purposes so in terms of resale wise these will not resell and make money um purely because i think people in uk don't really kind of i think gravitate towards these type of shoes i think if it was just like a normal shoe like a panda but just like you know um complete or whole as a panda is you know or just mirror the panda laws that I think people will find it nice. But I think it's only people that are into fashion, people that are into different, like, um, a parallel pieces, people that think outside the box when it comes to their feats and their styles, which, you know, they wear every single day. They will appreciate that. I'm one of them people as well. I do appreciate fashion, which is different, not everyday fashion. And I like it because I think it's confusing. So if you're watching someone walking and you look at their shoes, that kind of trip you up and it makes you want to pay more attention just to find out what's happening. So, beautiful shoe. It's coming out on July the 1st. It's coming out on Nike. As you guys can see, the back as well. Same language as well. Opposing colored panels. Beautiful. I like the Jordan Wing logo as well that's been stitched on there in that white threading. That looks beautiful as well. So, yes, that's my take on the shoe. It's a beautiful shoe. I would definitely recommend that you buy the leather does seem very durable i tend to find the leather which has got like the grainage versus the smooth leather is always more durable you know it doesn't crease as much and you know it's real leather the leather that is very smooth you tend to find is usually plastic and leather mixed together so that's a good sign so far and yes guys that's the end of the video thanks for watching if you got any questions make sure you comment down below and also before i forget as well in terms of styling tips what you can wear with the shoe um, you can wear like, you know, your black and your white colours. This shoe, I think, is versatile. It's for all seasons. So summertime, you can wear this with some black shorts, some black top, then put it on. In winter, you can wear this with all black and put it on. The white kind of adds a bit of colour to the to the um, fit as well. So it does offer that like option where you want to break off maybe all black or the black can offer the option if you want to break off from wearing all white from head you know, to your bottoms, it kind of, yeah, so it just complements whatever you wear. Um, can you wear other colors with this? Yes, you can wear gray as well. I think like a light gray tracksuit 
is I think the safest option to go for. If you want to play unsafe as well, give it a try. I'm not saying go and wear purple and green with this. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just try and stick as close as possible to the darker theme, you know. And yes, enough waffling. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Peace. God bless you. God bless you.